the Rajdhani Express was inaugurated on 1st March 1969 to run between Delhi and Howrah as an overnight super fast train for the business traveler. In 1969, the permitted top speed on Indian tracks was 100 km per hour. The Rajdhani was proposed to be run at 140 km per hour. Amid stiff opposition from the railway board and the zones through which the trains would run, debates over the safety at speeds higher than 100 km per hour persisted for two years from 1967 when trials were initiated. Eventually, the Howrah Rajdhani was allowed a top speed of 120 km per hour. Speed was increased to 130 km per hour in 1971. Three years after the Howrah Rajdhani was inaugurated, on 17th May 1972, a second Rajdhani Express was introduced to India's business capital, Bombay. Both trains went on to become big successes, with the Bombay Rajdhani soon taking the crown for the fastest train in India, an honour it retained till 1988 when the Bhopal Shatabdi Express started services at 140 km per hour. In the 1970s, the Bombay Rajdhani took 19 hours to cover the 1,385 km between Delhi and Bombay. Since 2018, the same distance is covered in 15 hours and 35 minutes. When inaugurated, the Bombay Rajdhani Express was hauled by a single re-geared WDM2 Alco diesel electric locomotive of the Ratlam Shed. With the arrival of the WAP-1 in the 1980s, the WDM-2 gave way to electric traction. It was the Rajdhani Express that provided the impetus for the development of the WAP-1. By 1987, the entire Delhi-Mumbai route was electrified, paving the way for through electric traction. But there was a problem. The Bombay Territory was under 1500 volts DC electric traction. The train was hauled up to Vadodara by a WAP-1. At Vadodara, the train was handed over to twin WDM-2s from the Ratlam Shed who would take the train to Bombay Central. With the arrival, of the WCAM-2P class AC-DC dual traction locomotives in 1993, the now iconic twin WDM-2s that characterized the Bombay Rajdhani Express were retired. At the same time, WAP-1 locomotives gave way to the iconic WAP-4s. The entry of three-phase AC-WAP-5 class locomotives saw the Baton changing hands once again from the WAP-4 to the WAP-5. In December 2003, the Rajdhani shifted from ICF to LHP cars. The number of cars were also gradually increased to 24. This necessitated a more powerful locomotive and this power was provided by the WAP-7 class with the Bombay Territory now under 25 kV AC traction, a WAP-7 takes the train from Delhi all the way to Bombay Central. One change still awaits this prestigious train, the shift to multiple unit train sets. What are your views? Please share in the comments section. If you like this video, and other videos on my channel. Please subscribe and press the bell icon.